Bowman here at BW1.com. We're going to check out the Intel X25M solid state drive. This particular solid state drive we have from Intel is the 80 gigabyte version. This is supposed to be their sort of mid, mid, mid range one between 160 gig and the 40 gig. This is supposed to be sort of the sweet spot in the series here. It's supposed to give you the best performance at the best value. This is the 80 gig version, like I said before. And we're going to do a quick unboxing to check it out. So, all right. There we go. Slide up like that. First thing here is a nice little, see here is a big caution on the drive here. We'll check that out in a second. Open it up. Get a nice My SSD Rock sticker. This looks like to be some directions and warranty information here. We have a nice little installation guide on a CD here. And they give you a nice mount here to mount it into a 2.5 inch disc. A 3.5 inch disc rather. So this mount here will allow you to install it into a desktop here and they give you the screws available to do so. So if you're going to use it in a desktop, you can convert it from 2.5 to 3.5 inches. If you want to use this, you want to use something a little, little more sophisticated, definitely check out the video I did on IC Dock, which is another, another tool that you can use as well that will take it from a 2.5 to a 3.5 inch size to use inside a desktop. Alright, so let's check out that's pretty much the accessories there. Just carefully open up the drive here. Kind of take a quick tour around. Right. As we slide it open here, so you can see the basics. Pretty much what you can see here, it has, it has a nice little rubber, sort of plastic uh, bumper around it. It's nice and light and weight. has a silver sort of finish to it. And on the bottom here, it's all flat, nothing on there. Pretty much normally what we see in a solid state drive. You can check out here in the front. You have your serial ATA connections, your power, your data. Now that we have it unboxed here, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to install it inside a computer here and we're going to check out the speeds they're supposed to get with the Intel X25M mainstream 80 gigabyte solid state drive. Okay, now we have the drive installed in our system here. We have Windows installed inside of it. I did some benchmarking and here are the results. So I used AS SSD benchmark as the tool to do the benchmark. And I'll put in the description exactly um, some rough specs of my computer. Definitely check out my video where I kind of described uh, what's in my computer fully. And um, also the description of sort of how AS SSD Benchmark kind of runs their benchmarking test. So it'll be all in the description. So just take a quick look here. Um, we'll go over some of the, some of the, um, the um, stats here. We have sequential read at about 250, 251 uh, mega, megabytes per second on the read and on the write 79.48. Um, we have 4K at 23.17 megabytes and the write at 47.32. We have read at, at 4K with, at 64 threads at 150.73 and write at 57.30. Access time is about 0 0.1 0.121 milliseconds and write for that is 0 0.093 milliseconds. So um, pretty fast drive here as you can see. Um, but um, that's just kind of giving you sort of a rough estimate of test. What I liked about this test, it does give you a copy benchmark test, which kind of simulates kind of how the drive is really going to work for you. So in these tests, um, what it does is kind of create an ISO to copy over and stuff like that. And that's, that ran at 159.03 megabits per second for speed, duration about 6.75 seconds. Program is 101.35 megabits per second at 13.88 um, seconds for duration and games where it kind of simulates sort of a randomized read and write and stuff like that. Basically how the system is really going to work. We got it at 158.84 with a duration of about 8.69 seconds. So those are the specs right there for the Intel X25M. This is an 80 gig, um, 80 gig drive. It's a solid drive. It's a mainstream drive. It's one of the more popular solid state drives out there. They get a lot of high ratings, a lot of good reviews, and it's no different here. This is a very, very good drive. Like I said, I use this as my operating system drive, my main drive here. I really do like it. It's really solid, and I definitely recommend it for those out there looking for a solid state drive with good performance. So this is Bowman here from BW1.com, reminding you to um, check the link in the description for uh, details and specs, sort of uh, how all this kind of, how, kind of all this benchmark here works. Uh, check the link in the description, obviously. Follow us on Twitter, subscribe to our YouTube page here, and always remember to live your tech world in high definition.